Curtis, give us a perspective on that. How much that hurt today? Yeah, it's a sucker punch. Obviously, I wouldn't say we'd done too much to, to win the game, but it was a nil-nil all day long. It wasn't a game I feel we deserved to lose, um, but that happens. Uh, obviously, I feel obviously after the Fulham game, I guess sometimes it happens both ways. So Fulham, we got a little bit of luck and managed to win the game, and today we're unfortunate and, and managed to lose it. Um, I don't like it to be too critical, but on the goal, should Greg have done better? Um, well, obviously, when on this this surface, like I talked about with um, saying it was a nil-nil all day long, the the conditions here with the wind and the surface, as the ball falls out, Joey catches it very well between my legs. So. I, I believe he was unsighted, so um, he'd be the one to tell you whether he should have done better. But it's just, like I say, it's just frustrating that you, you, you come through this game, like I say, in difficult conditions, in a game where they didn't really have too much, and um, and you do concede. But like I say, I, I, I go in there afterwards and, and say to lads, we've got lots of big games coming up, and um, we just need to stick together and make sure that we're ready for the next one. In fairness, I thought at the time in the second half you looked to the better side. Is that a fair thing to say? I agree, yeah. I think the first half they had a lot more of the ball and a lot more territory without doing too much other than set pieces. They were quite mm -hmm. dangerous. But um, but second half, I thought, yeah, I do, I do agree with you there that we were better. Um, Robbo flashed a lot of good balls right across the, the six-yard box, which you'd love someone to just yeah. get their toe on the end. But it wasn't to be, and that happens in this league, and, and we've got big games coming up all month, so... I'm hoping that we can win the next one and, and make sure we stay near the top. To me, the pick of the players look the defence. You look very solid. I know you've lost and conceded, but uh, as a defence, I thought you all looked on top of your game today. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad you said that. But um, yeah, we, we were organised. We were we were combative. We knew that if we do give Vokes and and Gray half a half a chance early, they'll take advantage and and they'll gain confidence from that. So we knew we had to be right on them and frustrate them and the fact that we managed to do that made them, I don't know, a bit disjointed, started dropping for balls that they don't usually do and um, and like I say, we, we managed yeah. to do alright but at the end of the day, folks did pop up with a goal and um, I'm sure he goes home happy. Yeah, how much did it knock your confidence as a team? Um, I don't think it knocks us, our confidence as a team. I think if you get battered here like from, for 90 minutes and then you lose the game, then yeah, because you know you, you were never in the game and you're worrying about the rest of the season. Whereas this game was a, was a tight game, it could have gone either way. A draw would have been the fair result, but like I say, you're able to, to win games that you don't maybe deserve, like the Fulham games. You lose games that you don't deserve to lose, and, and it's just better to be, to be good in, in more games, and, and you're going to have a better chance of winning. Just a, a final one, the, the usual contract question the manager, I think, indicated yesterday that decisions might be left to the end of the season. Is that how you are with that? Or, um, or are you still close? No, I'm, I'm not. I want to say the end of the season. It's just, um, obviously, just like anything, you just have to make sure it's right for yourself. And um, I'm not sure it'll be the end of the season, to be honest. Um, me, personally, if I could agree something beforehand, I'd, I'd be happy to do that. But um, like I say, it's not just jumping on something because it's there. You always need to think of the whole bigger picture. And... Um, I say I'm enjoying it here, and I'd, I'd love to stay here and, and, and particularly be here in the Premier League. So, um, touch wood, <laughs> we'll uh, we'll keep doing well, and then hopefully um, we'll get something sorted.